What's up, guys? It's your girl Megan. And your boy Drew. All right, so for God, Danielle, you got your your favorite part. <laughs> your boy Drew. Let's jump in there. Hey, hey, hey. Go ahead. I'm trying. We'll get to it. Don't rush me. You rush. Go. You tried it. All right. <laughs> So for today's video, like I mentioned in the other video, I'm not sure which one will come out first, but either way, um, one of our YouTube subscribers, our family members, because we hate to call, label you guys as subscribers. Anyway, so our family member um, reached out to us in our email and had some questions or wanted us to give her advice on a situation that she's going through. Okay. So... I'm going to go ahead and read it. She's going to remain, remain anonymous. And um, we're going to respect her wishes and just read the email out to you guys. And we'll give you our honest opinion. honest opinion. But before we get there, please be sure to give us those big thumbs up. Subscribe in. Share this video on all of your social media, however you see fit. All right, baby. All right. So it's a long one. So, All right. Um, well, of course, she starts off. I'm one of your YouTube subscribers, you family girl. I love your channel, by the way. I watched your live today and I saw where you said we can email you and you can give us advice. Okay. I'm not sure if this is the email I should send it to. I saw this is the description box, but I couldn't remember what email you said in the live. But I do have a situation I wanted some advice on. So, I've been talking to this guy that I've had a crush on for a while now. We're like friends, I should say. But I like him more than a friend, and I think he likes me too. He never actually said he did, and I never told him I liked him either. But it's the things he does that makes me think he likes me, or maybe he's just being nice. He says real sweet things. When I see him, when I see him, we talk and vibe, and we can talk about any and everything. He looks out for me. He's always happy to see me. He checks in on me. If I need a ride or something of that sort, he'll do it. He looks at me a certain way, good ways. And he flirts with me also. But I'm a bit confused because we started texting recently. And sometimes he'll text and then when I reply, he doesn't reply back. And sometimes he'll call me and we'll talk for a few on the phone. And then I won't hear from him until days later. Like sometimes I feel maybe he doesn't like me like that and it's all in my head, but I really like him. It's to the point where I get mad if I don't hear from him. I've been there. <laughs> anyway, I don't want to put myself out there to him because there's nothing I can go off of and I don't want to look stupid. But here's the thing. He's single, but he has women he messes with and a baby mother I believe he's on, off, on and off with. I'm not sure so it's like I don't know what to do I really like him and I want more from him I was wondering if there's any advice you can give me on my situation so we said it was a long one but it's full of red flags yeah so all right here we go like I said it's full of red flags he has women that he sees or dates or hangs out with and he has a baby mother yeah two red flags right there but, i mean oh, and man. those are big red flags i mean but he's doing that, all the, the only thing that got me he's doing all the other things to show okay go ahead. No, you, I'm, you're not interrupting me. I'm just giving you that side eye because that was about to lead into what I was about to say. Go ahead, run. Because those are two major red flags that because you're feeling this person, you're willing to overlook. Oh. You're willing to overlook them because you are so into him. Yeah, that's... If you know he has women, multiple women, because this is what you said... He has multiple women and a baby mother that you know he's on and off with. Why are you putting yourself in that situation to be side chick number three? But then, um, it's a flip side. So on this flip side, 
I'm putting this, I'm putting myself in this no, guy go ahead. situation real quick. On this flip side, say for instance, I'm this guy. I'm feeling you like that. We're not together. And of course, I got a baby mama. Mm-hmm. I want to show you this attention and I'm, I'm really interested in you, but I can't really commit to you because my baby mama could ha- hold, be holding something over my head possibly or one of the other side girls I'm messing with, I possibly could be feeling her too. Then if that's the case, then why string me alone? Because I don't want to cut it off because I don't Because really you want know. your cake and candy too. But no, I, I don't really know where... Which one of you guys I want to be with right now? Yeah, I mean, it, it depends on how are they really. Um, are we in the bedroom tight, or are we just I'm picking you up and I'm doing things for you tight? But see, that goes back to being in the friend zone. Because he can be doing all these things. He's telling you what you want to hear. He's telling you that you're nice. He's telling you that you're pretty. He's telling you that you're... He's doing everything for you. Yeah. He could be looking out for you like you're my little sister. Yeah, that... And don't know that he's, you know... But... He's into you. But my thing is this. If you know he has these multiple women and... Even excluding the baby mama because the baby mama but may that, not even be yeah, in the picture. In the picture, yeah. I mean, and I was just about to say that it, the baby mama or the other person might not even be in the picture. I mean, the side woman. I wonder how do he really even talk to the side woman? When she say days at a time, that's what got me. But the, no, 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 there. because she said that she they can text, but then when they text, there's there could be days or whatever in between. That's a long. That's a long so, time. Of course, they gotta be in the same state because she say, you know, he be reaching out for, you know, if you need a ride. He's looking somewhere. out for a yeah. Right. So that's a long time for being. That's in the why same I state. said yeah, so there's more to it's it. It's a lot of red flags. And you can be dating here. multiple people because you're dating. Yeah. But if you're in a committed relationship, you can't. Then, and if that's what you're looking for, why you put yourself look. in that situation to be side chick number three? Yeah, and, and definitely you don't want to be side chick number three. You, you don't want to be that. So my because that is cake and candy too. Exactly because, that, because that's he's telling a lot of women along right there, right now. He's telling you all these things that you want to hear. He's boosting up your your ego oh. to make it to make it seem like it's in your head. But he's doing everything he want to do to her to keep her it's on to the keep hook. her on the back burner. Yeah, to keep because her on he doesn't want to leave. You. He doesn't want to lose you. Yeah, and and he may be in it to try to will you in, but. If, but if that's what, but what if? But now hold on before I, I lose what I'm about to say. Because if if that's what he wants to do, and if he's really into you, and all of these things that he's saying is because he has interest in you, then you make time for things that you want and yeah. people that you want. So if you guys are texting and he, you guys are calling, there's no reason that you should go days without talking to this person. Yeah, and I'm quite sure you know where he lives. Yeah. But I mean that's beside the point because you ain't just gonna pop up over in nobody's house without yeah, being invited. But man. my thing is this: if he's really feeling you and he wants to be with you and wants to start this connection with you, then why are the other women there? Because baby mama, I know why. Well, I'm I'm not talking about the baby mama because you can't do nothing about the baby yeah. mama. She's gonna She's be there sad. for the rest of her of his life. Yeah. So there's nothing that you could do about that. My time thing is talking about these other women. I don't know about the other. So if it's like you, there's no reason unless you want to play the field. There's no reason to have these other women what there. If, what, what if though? What if if he's getting a different vibe from her? That's showing him that I can be a friend zone with her too, and possibly get some benefits. That could. That's a good. And that's, that's why thing. he keep showing her affection, you know, in those Until he ways. gets what he wants. And if he know, like, say for instance, if I know you're going to, I'm going to shoot you a text. And I know I'm good for two or three days off you before you respond. That's a good thing. 
Why not? They only get away. People only get away with what you allow them to. Yeah, you're gonna get so mad you for have a second to, and then be cool. You oh, have cool. to to set some boundaries, and that commu- like I said, that communication has to be there. Yeah, it, it so be. if you're on, un- you're uncomfortable with the amount of time that it's taking for you guys to communicate for him to reach out and talk to you. Block you him, gotta let him know. Yeah, either let, let him know off top. Hey, this ain't how. I Th- run. Let him know that this isn't how it's gonna mm-hmm. go. He can't keep stringing you along. If you really want to get a true reaction out of him, cut him off. Cut him off. If you want, you didn't a real mention reaction, that you guys were friends with off. benefits. So if you are friends with benefits, cut it off. Yeah, cut it off. If, if cut you it want off and see reaction, where it goes. See where it goes. Either he gonna do two things. He's gonna leave you alone, or he's gonna show he's up. gonna reach out and be like, okay, what's going what's on? What's going on? He's gonna show up because then you just let him know one thing. He, I'm not, not going to allow this. You're not going to do this to me. And that's Stop what I off. said. Why put yourself, why give yourself the opportunity to be number three? Yeah. You have the ultimate power in this relationship. Even regardless if it's a sexual relationship, something that's leading into a uh, actual yeah, relationship line, or women. just a friend. You have the control over that. So don't allow him to do something that you aren't willing to put up with. And, and bottom line, women... They have that power. They say get your butt out the house. I mean, yeah. it's time to get your butt out the house. I mean, point blank, period. No, I mean, we got a little power here, but women run that house. You need a woman's permission to run that house. Yep. Point blank, period. Don't get it twisted. Oh, yeah. Don't, don't reach so goddamn. No. <laughs> I'm I, just I, saying. I mean, for real, though. We, we. If you set that standard, you're going to see what type of guy he really is. Yeah. And don't be afraid to put yourself out, out there. there. Yeah, because like you like you, you mentioned, you, you don't, don't have to know say hardcore either. You yeah. can do you can do lightweight standard. Just be like, hey, if this is something you really interested right. in, you, see how deep this really is. Yes, you so guys you need hang to talk with him more. Hang you out need with him to have that conversation, but you need to have a conversation with him and be to like, okay, is. look, yeah. I've been feeling this way. I don't know if you're feeling this and way. I want to do right his uh, child and everything also right now too and stuff like that. What does that have to do with? But no, I'm, I'm just saying how close are is she really with him and his family and what's going on? But what does that have to do with that? So she would know what's going on. She'd so what you gonna, you're going to ask his family? No, I mean she's in the friend zone. She, she can get close to somebody around and know what's really going on. But why you gotta go to the the you get you can get it from the horse's mouth? Right now the horse's mouth ain't speaking because she ain't opening her mouth to ask because she's afraid to put herself out there. Sure, get your resources, girl. Well, yeah, get your resources. But I'm, but I'm saying you can't. Hell, okay. So if no, I'm just saying. Come, I'm just saying. So you coming. mean to tell me that? As close as you and your brother are, yeah. If his girl that was in the friend zone come to you, be like, "Hey, Drew, now nah, you I like, exactly." You you so how here. you how you gonna and tell he, her he to reach more, out to he the family? Back to him, man, who that chick is? So man. how so how you gonna <laughs> how you gonna have her to reach out to the family or the friends because they ain't gonna give her the truth? Everybody ain't got that type of loyalty. Their loyalty is to the friend. They, I mean, to yeah. the family. They don't know her. I scratched that. Don't wanna, don't wanna do <laughs> so, that. no. You need to talk to him. Yeah, you do need to talk to him. But, yeah, bottom line, you got to talk to him. Y'all got to talk. You do. And, and if, I was trying to give you another avenue. That ain't going to work, obviously. <laughs> if, if you're that afraid to put yourself out there or to, to reach out to him, then maybe he's not the person for you. Yeah. But, because you shouldn't be afraid to talk to somebody that but you, days at a time, you have interest in. Days at a time for you to reach back out to me. That means, therefore, he's not interested in you right now. Or he's interested in you and a few other people. He's and spending right now, time with other people. somebody else got my attention. Somebody else has somebody his else attention. Somebody else got my attention more you. than you right now. So, I'm going to go hang out with them. And then, when they get boring, I'm going to holler back at you. Exactly. Pretty much. When I have time to fit you, in, check you in, is that's when I'm going to do yeah. it. So... So this video don't get long and windy because y'all know how we can talk. <laughs> y'all, you need to have a conversation with him. And guys, please, hey, you got any other better comments? Please drop them at the bottom. Leave those comments. Help we got to help our family out now. Help them out now. Come on. 
So, so if we miss something, definitely drop it in the yeah, comments. Yeah, because everybody has a different perspective yeah, of things. And I love the different views. Right. Yeah. So this isn't a, a two-sided discussion. This, this is a discussion for the family. Yeah. And we're figured out. So, yeah. Well, guys, please be sure to give us those big thumbs up. Subscribe, man. Share this video on all of your social media, however you see fit. All right, guys. Have a good one. Peace. Bye. Hey, hey family. Thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. Please be sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Also, check out our latest video and be sure to subscribe. Bye, Bye guys. guys.